Hi, it's Andy Lockwood from College Funding Specialists in Plainview, Long Island. And I, talk, I wanted to shoot this quick video because I just came across a report that was really troublesome for me. The report talked about how students and parents who are otherwise eligible for the federal Pell Grant, that's a grant that is typically, not always, but typically awarded to low-income families. These students went ahead, they filled out the FAFSA, and uh, applied for financial aid the right way, and they were uh, told that they were indeed eligible for this type of grant, which is significant. You know, it's, it's a few thousand dollars. It helps. And then what happened was the schools verified. Uh, the, the verification process is kind of like an audit, but not as bad. But the schools then asked for some additional information, which, of course, is within their uh, prerogative. The, the issue is how do they ask for that information? And uh, they may claim that they're asking straight in a straightforward manner and all that, but the numbers kind of speak for themselves. And this is what was reported by, uh, by, by this study. One out of every three, that's one third of every family that is eligible for the Pell Grant did not get their money, which to me is just nuts. Why didn't they get their money? Because they were so confused by the verification process that they didn't, you know, they, they couldn't follow through with it. And, uh, you know, what I've always been saying, and, and my partner, College Pete, we've been talking about this till we're, we're blue in the face for years, is that you have to understand that colleges are a business. So they're not, sure, they give out financial aid, but you have to know how to work the system because it's not always in a business's interest to dole out some money that you deserve. So in these cases, you know, I, I, I'm just conjecturing here, but in these cases, not only were the Pell Grants not issued, but whatever other financial aid was, was not issued also because of this verification process that these families couldn't figure out how to get through. Uh, you know, if a school is going to verify, you would think that someone in the financial aid office would contact the families and walk them through it. So one out of every three students are not getting money that they deserve, which is uh, outrageous to me. So anyway, so a college funding specialist uh, here in New York and at our office in, uh, in Weston, Florida, what we do is we help parents navigate the financial aid system. Um, your best bet to figure out how all this stuff works, including the verification process, including how to negotiate with colleges, including the secret formula that's used by every college to figure out how much money to give you and a lot of other stuff, you should visit uh, either my website, collegefundingspecialists.com, or you go there and then you click on a link for the workshops that we're holding and then you will get good information if you register and you attend. Okay, so hopefully either I or College Pete will see you at an upcoming workshop in the near future. Thanks for watching.